Hello and welcome to my episode of a cup of tea and an interview. So Grace, cup of tea. This is my makeup artist, Grace Hockley. How are you? I'm good, thanks. How are you? I'm right, thank you. So Grace specialises in special effects makeup and prospect prosthetics. Prosthetics. <laughs> and are you going off to university too? Yeah, hopefully next year I'll be doing a makeup course. Oh sweet, that sounds so cool. Alright, well, let's drink this cup of tea and get on with the interview. Okay. Right, Grace. How long have you been working as a makeup artist or how long have you kind of been into it and like when did you first find your interest kind of thing? Well, I first became interested in secondary school towards year 11. Okay. And then since then I've just been doing more research and about it and I've just really got into it. Mm, brilliant. Yeah. So today we did like a bit of a test of uh, the real thing. So Grace came over, we did a test on my actor, uh, Stuart Grove and uh, we just see what it looked like, see what we wanted on the actual day. So Grace, can you tell us how you kind of achieved this look and like kind of what product you use, like a bit of a walkthrough for us? Okay, well I started off using liquid latex, which I just painted onto the face in, with a thin layer. And then I stuck some cotton wool buds onto it. And then I spilled it up like in the shape of a circle. So you know, represent a bit of all. Yeah. And then I let that dry and then I put some cream blend over it in the natural skin colour. So it just so it like blends in with the skin. And then over that I put some red like cream blend obviously for the blood. And then I did the fake blood in and then added different creams in just to make it more realistic. Oh really? thank you. <laughs> so can you just kinda like say which uh, products you use in like a, like the order, I'll just go through them and I'll put little pictures here okay. so I can see. Okay, first I used liquid latex okay. and then some cotton wool balls. and then I use a cream blend palette okay. and then a breeze room. They, have, they basically, they both have creams in, so yeah. and then after that I use coagulated blood. Oh, <laughs> is it like a thick one? Yeah, yeah, it's like a thick blood. And I use stage blood. And then I just use some brushes with it just to achieve the look. Brilliant. Yeah. It looked absolutely fantastic, Grace. I'm really oh, happy with thank it. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so I just wanted to kind of ask you what kind of thing inspired you to create your look. Um, well, it's based on the character and what you've told me about the character and the narrative of the film. Yeah. <laughs> Is there any uh, particular makeup artists that influence you in general or for this project? Or um, In general, I'd have to say I'm a makeup artist called Rick Baker and he does, he specialises in film makeup. Okay. And yeah, he's like worked on quite a few films and yeah, he really influences me. Have you got any like makeup tips for you know other people watching or for younger younger makeup artists or any tips in general for anyone? Okay, well for an everyday makeup look, when you're applying makeup, it's just important to blend everything together. Okay. So if you're doing eyeshadow or foundation, whatever it is, just make sure you blend it thoroughly. I'll take that into account when I do makeup. <laughs> there goes. Did you did you completely come up with it yourself, or did you base it on anything? Um, well, actually, the shape of it, I actually came up with it on the, you know, when I was doing it. But more or less, like the blood and the creams, I like knew what I was doing because with that, you kind of have to like keep to it to make sure it looks realistic. Yeah. So yeah. Oh wow! <laughs> Are you excited for when we actually do it? Yeah, I'm so excited. I'm so excited too. I'm really glad you're doing it for us. I feel like it's going to create that like, more professional look. Yeah for my film and yeah. yeah definitely I feel like instead of just having a bit of you know blood this forehead it'll create a bit more <laughs> realism to my yeah. film. Thank you very much Grace, cheers to that!